from Morocco, Adnan Remal. And from the... Antibiotics are very important drugs that save millions of lives. But the overuse of antibiotics lead to the selection of multi-resistant bacteria. Antibiotic-resistant bacteria can come from food, for example. Even in delicious Moroccan food, they come from animal products in our alimentation because the farmers give antibiotics not when they are sick, but just to boost the growing of these animals. To fight antibiotic-resistant bacteria, we thought about essential oils that are extracted from aromatic plants like uh, eucalyptus, oregano, thyme. They contain some molecules that have antibacterial activity, better than antibiotics sometimes. I combine antibiotic with some natural molecules and obtain a very amazing synergistic effect that kill multi-resistant bacteria. The boasting concept works also for anti-malaria and anti-fungal drugs. I decide to change the focus of my research from the curative approach for human to a preventive approach in animal. And I developed a product which is 100% natural. It is a very good alternative to antibiotics because it gives to the farmers better results without extra cost. The positive side effect is that meat is of higher quality and more tasty. I consider that infectious diseases are the most threatening disease in the world, especially for developing countries. This is why I devoted my research to this problem. Today I'm proud to see that I'm in the right path. Digital audio compression. Giuseppe Ramuzzi and team. Treatments for chronic kidney disease. Jan van den Bogart and Oliver Haydn. Rapid blood test for malaria. Hans Klevers. Lab-grown human organs. Laurent Lestarki and team. Radio signals for better satellite navigation. Sylviane Muller. Treating lupus. James G. Fujimoto and team. High-resolution medical imaging. Walid Hassanein, sustaining transplant organs. Adnan Ramal, boosting antibiotics with essential oils. Gert Jan Huter, plant based plastic bottles. Günther Hufschmidt, super sponge for oil spills. Steve Lindsay, energy saving rotary air compressor. Elmar Mock, swatch, ultrasound welding, and more. Reno Rapuoli, Novel vaccines by gene analysis. Axel Ulrich, stopping cancer at the root. Ladies and gentlemen, for the announcement of the popular prize, please welcome on stage the winner of last year's popular prize, Dr. Helen Lee. The winner of the 2017 European Inventor Award in the category of Popular Prize goes to <laughs> Professor Adnan Remal. Professor Remal, please come on stage to accept your award.
Professeur Habibi. Sorry. Professeur Remal Mbrouk Habibi. Félicitations. Why do you think your invention has captured the public imagination in such a way? Uh, I think uh, my uh, invention is uh, just uh, something that uh, everybody uh, wants to, to know, that uh, w if you have infection, we have a weapon. Uh, so uh, I dedicate my all my uh, life, my career, to this uh, problem because uh, I think, uh, as a researcher, I have to do. I had to do that, <laughs> and uh, uh, I want now to, to to say just uh, thank you, everybody. Thank you for uh, IPO. Thank you for my professors. Uh, when I was student, they teach me many things, and also thank you to my family and uh, to my scientific family, which are my students. Thank you for all. Now, can you remember what inspired you to go and use essential oils fighting against bacteria? Uh, uh, just uh, to, it's inspired me that uh, Really, uh, sometimes in the nature we have some some problem which can uh, arrive, just uh, like infection. But uh, in the nature we can find the solution. Mm -hmm. This this is uh, my uh, my inspiration. Yeah. All of everything is in the nature. You have just to find it. Now, you've already taken your work in a new direction with feed for livestock. What can we expect next from you? Uh, you know, uh, uh, farmers are doing a good job because they produce uh, us and for all the world, the population of the world, which is growing and growing, they, they give us uh, something to eat. So I have a lot of uh, respect to the farmers. but. Uh, when uh, they are using antibiotics in uh, animal feed, they, uh, they are doing something bad to the uh, human health. So my contribution was to help these farmers to get good uh, results with their uh, uh, job without, uh, without uh, make something bad for uh, human health. And uh, I hope I managed to do this problem, this, uh, so to find the solution for this problem. Well, I, I hope that in all the world, not only in Europe, in all the world, the, the use of antibiotics in animal feeds must be banned and replaced by natural alternative because this natural alternative exists. Okay, thank you. Now, I understand that this is the first time that Morocco is bringing a drug to the market. How does that make you feel? Yeah, yes, it's the first time um, Morocco or African country is, uh, is in this uh, competition. And uh, I, I would uh, just uh, thank the UPO for, uh, for uh, this uh, distinction because I'm sure it will... Uh, give a lot, lot of uh, experience of, uh, of uh, young people in, uh, in uh, third world countries, in Africa, in, uh, will, uh, will uh, continue to trust in the possibility for them to, to work and to see the, the benefit of the work. Thank you very much. Another big round of applause. Please step forward for the pictures.
Félicitations. Mbrouk.